You're, you're nine minutes late. What's that? You're nine minutes late. I know. You know. And, What's and the problem? In, in this business, Charles, there's no such thing as being on time. Have you seen DOG? DOG? Yeah. How you doing? It's nice, DOG. When'd you get him? He just sit down, have a seat. Yeah. DOG is belongs to us. He's a family dog. Nice, nice. Yeah. No, he's sitting he's right beside you. Yeah. And there's too much bullshit. He bites. That's why I'm sitting across from him. Ah, he wouldn't bite me. Mm. Look at you. Look at you. The minute, the minute you lie, he bites you. Oh, I don't lie. He don't lie. Oh, Jesus, he bit me. <laughs> Already. <laughs> See? He's a good boy, D.O.G. Wait till he starts barking. <laughs> uh, that's, uh, that, that's why he's on that side. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, you had an announcement. Uh, you made an announcement. You were in the news last night. And uh, what's, what's the story? Well, the story is, Charles, promise made is a debt unpaid and the debt's going to be paid July the 1st. And what's that? Uh, the Gagetown Ferry is going to be operating. The Gagetown Ferry is going to be operating. How do you manage that? Why, well, how, how do you manage to, uh, why did you fight to have the Gagetown Ferry uh, well, Charles, being put there again? Well, Charles, uh, my wife and I, and, and actually my sons have been business owners, or were business owners in Gagetown for probably 25 years. And uh, we saw the uh, economic activity that came off the ferry, do you know, from uh, people living on the other side, coming to shop in Gagetown. Um, farmers using it to travel both sides And that's of the why river. you fought for it? Well, that's one of the reasons, yeah. You're lying. Oh, D.O.G. Biden, you're well, lying. Why? You know Bert Green? I know Bert Green. Well. And he sent you an email a few weeks ago. Yes. And he said he wanted you to put the Gagetown Ferry in action. Didn't he? Yeah, he did send it something on yeah. Facebook. Yeah. Did you read it? Yeah. Yeah. So that's the reason you fought for the Gagetown Ferry, because of Bert Green, right? Sure, why not? <laughs> He told me to tell you that <laughs> last. Bert, he told me last Bert, night. Bird is a great guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I wish yeah. I had his voice, huh? Oh my. Yeah. Okay. You said last summer to me that if the ferry wasn't there, you would resign, and the ferry wasn't there last summer, and it's here this summer. So how do we have it last summer? Um, well, By the way, the resign that was just you were just pissed off. Oh, was that? Okay. Yeah, just to me, you didn't make oh, okay. That's okay. Um, so, you know, the ferries are mechanical, and, you know, things, things can happen. And um, what happened last year, I had, I had hoped to see it come, but something happened that one of the other ferries had to come off the run. I don't know, Charles. I can't remember what happened yesterday, let alone last Are you getting week. that? Is it not full to get old? No, what are the alternatives? You don't remember. I love getting Or you them. have selective uh, listening or well, selective wife, my, remember, my, selective memory. My wife says it's selective memory. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's what I think it is. And uh, no, no, but I mean, uh, okay, so it was mechanical problems. Well, I, look, I'm not sure, but uh, what I do know is. Where did we get the money all of a sudden? That's what I'd like, well, I'd like to know. Well, see, Billy, Billy Fraser. Who's him? That's right. But former the, B, Billy Fra former minister B, Billy Fraser the late the the late uh, the late uh, minister of transportation and a good friend of mine yeah no there's yeah. nothing there uh, no, no, no 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 but sorry no, no. we're talking about fans. um so oh, sorry. the the, um, the, uh, the previous government the uh, liberals yeah the liberal government uh, gave out a contract uh, to a private ferry operator uh, for nine approximately. That, the that's a, one? No, Canada Cases Island. Okay. And my suggestion to the Department of Transportation back then is to do what we're doing today. And what we're doing today is we're going to be running the um, Peninsula Princess I think four to six times a day over to Canada Cases Island. So really we're saving close to nine hundred thousand dollars right there. So, uh, is this private? What we're going to see July 1st? No, no. Okay. No, th this is what the former Liberal government was doing. They had a private operator uh, supplying service to Kennebecasis Island. So now we're going to be using the Island Princess to go over there, I think probably six times a day. 
and that's going to cost extra yeah there's no doubt about it but it's not going to cost nine hundred thousand dollars and it's not going to cost uh, you know a great deal of money to operate the uh, ferry in well, how many ferries is there in the St. John I River? think I think now th these are questions you should be asking Bill Oliver. Bill Oliver, Minister but of Transportation. You, you asked me how many cows, I can tell you cows, but um, I think there's six or seven. How many, cow, how many, how many farmers is there in St. John River? Oh geez, there's a lot. That's a political answer. I know. Uh, I Dog didn't that. bite you. Can you, be, <laughs> can you show me a picture, send me a picture of the St. John River before the Mactaquai Dam? Um, and I, I I seen a picture at uh, mm, whatever, and it's yeah. beautiful. All uh, oh, I'm sure, but beautiful, all the farmland yeah. and everything. Anyway, forget focus. Yeah. yeah. But okay. So how many ferries is there? Uh, uh, I believe there's six or seven, Charles. And those ferries attract tourists. That is That's beautiful. Right. It is. It is. They go from one. Is there any uh, any other province that has uh, a beautiful uh, river system like the St. John River that has cable ferries? Across is it? there? I don't believe so. No, there's none in Quebec. No. 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 Or they, or they, they build bridges there. Well, they just, they just don't have a beautiful uh, river system. So the bottom, so the bottom line is, uh, what I was going to ask, why it was so beautiful, it went so good. Why did the Liberals cut it in the first place? You'd have to ask them that, Charles. No, you, you, you should know. Uh, is it? Did they use it a lot, or? Do you think it was political? Yeah, but okay, um, what's the last time there was a liberal MLA elected in your writing? Um, well, I. Frank McKenna? Blaine no, v what was Blaine? No, Blaine uh, Vaughan? Oh, no. Well, um, the last one from Gagetown would have been Vaughn. Vaughn, yeah. Nice guy. Very nice. Pissed off liberal. Vaughn Blaney. Uh, supported the Gagetown ferry. He, yes. He was a pissed a piss off, off liberal. liberal. Yeah. Yes, I remember that. Uh, then, then Eugene McGinley. Eugene, yeah. God bless and, his soul. Yeah, nice guy. Very nice. And, Polite gentleman. Yeah. And um, so I've been uh, the elected member since 2002. So I hear your speech last night. As long as I am your PC, PC MLA, the ferry will stay here. Isn't that political? Uh, no, I said as long as I am the uh, the uh, progressive conservative. Uh, oh no, as long as I am the member of the legislature, and there's a progressive conservative government in power. There'll be a ferry here. You're trying to make me feel bad, make me be sure I'm politically correct as long as we have. So, in other words, the Liberals could take power, which they are one day, mm -hmm. not there forever. Mm -hmm. um, and then the first thing they're going to chop is the Gagetown Ferry. Well, as long as I'm a government member, yes, that's all I can. fight and blah, blah, yeah. blah. And I'll, I'll, I'll still uh, fight to support the ferry. So how come, they're, how come they want to cut? That ferry, but I don't know. You should ask them, Charles. No, you never asked the bureaucrats. Uh, never asked Bill Oliver, like he could investigate. Bill why. Oliver wouldn't meet with me. Bill Oliver would not meet. He there's, wouldn't meet with me. Uh, and and there's your premier that just came yeah. in with a mask on. Yeah, um, I have mine, Charles. You know, by the way, Charlie, can you get me a Scottish one, a tartan one that can match my hat? The Kate yeah. Rogers told me that there's some inside. I don't know. You have look. So the bottom line, we're happy. The ferry is going to open July 1st. Yeah. Congratulations. And the citizens are very happy. It took a long time. It took a long time, yeah. So the next time the Liberals get in power, I have to ask yeah. them if they're going to well, chop it up. Well, you should have to ask them that. You should ask Mr. Vickers that. Is it the bureaucrat that knows it's not being used a lot? I think it's the bureaucrats that don't like the ferry system, Charles, and they bring it forward uh, about closing it, and some governments agreed. Now, if you talk to Vaughn, Vaughn will say that the closing of the Gagetown Ferry was brought forward when he was a member. Uh, it was brought forward when uh, we so were in the Allward government, in, you know, being, brought forward, you know, to cut the ferry cut. system, yeah. But, um, again, as long as I'm there, I'll be fighting for the The farmers ferry. are very happy. They are, yeah. They don't have to use a canoe to go across. Well, they don't have to take that drive uh, on the Trans-Canada Highway yeah. with uh, a tractor doing 35 kilometers an hour and a car doing 120. It's safety. Charles, nice to see you. I got to go and fight the good fight for the people of New Brunswick, and that's what I'm going to go do. Uh, you and me.